This edition of the Riddler Report is brought to you by Freekeen.com. Dr. Paul is going to make his way to the front of the building, so if you'd like an autograph or to get a picture taken, he'll be at the front, so if we can get an orderly line. If you have a Sharpie, you can cut the line to the front. <laughs> he can only do about 15 to 20 minutes because we have an interview to do. So if you could please let Dr. Paul go to the front of the building, you can see him on your way out. Have your cameras ready. Have any literature ready you want him to sign? And if you have a sharpie, you get to cut to the front if we keep it.
about 12, 12.05, so if you all want to stick around, we're going to do a live shot here, right here on the steps. It'd be great if you could all stick around with your signs. Hey! No, a little bit more than that. There's no way that they can pay it. You know, the, the interest payments alone will take up, you know, a quarter or a third of the federal budget. So, is there a way to avoid it? Uh, Egypt people is very nice, and if the Egypt people take my advice, they will strike down the one party state they fear. But that had better not happen here. Cause we know that everything would fall apart if the city of Keene, New Hampshire starts to listen to the malcontents at Free Keene and sort of kind of cut spending cause the government needs some expensive things like the wasteful 34 West building and the boondoggle jail where we put hat wearers and other people who could be considered swearers Freaking.com